Think of the children! Think of the children! Hello boys and girls, welcome to a new episode of Forest Village Life is Feudal. I've done the liberty to myself of continuing a little bit where I left off last time. And I built a nice wall around these little places. Because I wanted to do that actually. And... It's looking pretty nice. Like this is like one enclosure. Now not everything is finished as I want it to be. Because I need to terraform it before I can actually build here as well. But at least this place will be a little bit more safe. From attacks from monsters and whatnot. But there's a lot of stuff as you can see to be built here. Hmm. So let's hope that the seasons will not be very bad for us and we don't lose enough uh, too much resources let's get into it let's let's see what we can get to today and go so here we are and uh, wood pillars has been built we have our little fence here and i wonder what this guy is doing what, what is he building here oh must be the road actually okay yeah i totally forgot about the road there so anyway, so we still have some bears in here. I don't know how they get there. I think he's kind of trapped in here. Well, not really. He can go out in a lot of ways. But it seems like it's going to be way better. It's like fenced in a lot of places. Which should prevent some animals from coming over, hopefully. Although these bears right here, they're kind of scary. Maybe we should try to get rid of them. Um, as they serve not really any purpose right here. I'm gonna go to this lady here. Take my bow. Take the bow. And... Oh. <laughs> That's how easy it is. Okay, let's search for the other bear. Is there, there is more nearby. Oh boy. I hate how mouse sensitive this is. Really, really crappy. Anyway, that went perfectly. Okay, you cannot go like this. Hmm, is there anything else like really close nearby? Maybe a fox. Like they look like they could eat my future chickens. Sorry, little fox. You have to go. And there's another bear. Can I hit him from here? That's far away though. Yeah, I think we can. Yep, perfect. What's this? Oh no, that's, a, that's just a rock. We cannot hit a rock. Hmm. I think we make it almost safe. I think this is going to play an important role, especially at the beginning. To make sure that our chicken coop farm is healthy. And... Okay, my lady can have her body back. <laughs> so anyway, still our seven things are being made. I have no idea what. Because all of them seem to be... Paused. So maybe it's about time we start actually building that house. I think it's it's I think it's the right time. Um, I'm gonna increase our village by five people. So I will be pausing this small house after this one is built, of course. So we I built the hunting cabin because it was really necessary. There was more and more and more animals coming in up here. Um which I need to scare them off. They're not scared of this scarecrow. Because only birds are scared of that. And I don't think even birds are scared of them. So anyway. Now we see less animals roaming around here. We have our hunting cabin. And there is a guy in there. We have enough fish to last. For actually not that much. <laughs> we need more fisher fishermen actually. Um, that would be pretty good. But eh. Let's see what we can do about that. I, I like these uh, fishing things that I have right now. But it is going down a little bit slowly. My goal of hitting 500 of these fish spines is almost there as well. Or so our vegetables. Just keeps growing like crazy. I don't even know if everything is in there. No, so there is actually 3,000 3, somewhere else. So I'm thinking 3,000 in here? Oh yeah. Dang, they have a lot of vegetables right there. 
So, with that, we also got some oats. So, we improved on that part. Yeah, now they're not gonna make anything. Now, we have a lot of babies, as you can see. Five babies and one teenager. Damn! I'm thinking maybe we should start building, like, a school or something. And so they will be more efficient in the future. They work even harder. And maybe it will actually help me in some ways. I don't know how much it will help and, and what kind of a speed boost it will give. But anything basically is, is kind of welcome. Um, of course, I will need a teacher for that. Hmm. Where should I put a school? I don't really have any space for a school anymore. And... Bim, 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 bim. Damn. Finding a school is actually really hard. <laughs> like a place to put them in. Ooh, I, saw, I saw a nice spot. Like, this is a nice spot. Oh yeah, I like this. Let's see. Like this one? I like that. There, There is like a nice place. Anyway, that's just for the layout, of course. I might uh, in the future actually maybe terraform some more stuff. So I will have more space. And I need to do that. This one needs to be start getting terraformed. So we can start building like fields, windmills. Right now, windmills is, is actually pretty pretty okay. So it's not really my priority. But another bakery with another person inside would be nice. Now, maybe I'm thinking, what's more important? Teacher or one more windmill? Hmm. I'm thinking maybe teacher more important. I mean, if it does speed up everything, let's see what it does. Increased Productivity. Increased productivity is, is, is pretty nice. Why not? We're gonna go with the school first. School before food, I guess. <laughs> so uh, anyway, I hope that uh, the increased productivity also goes over to making foods and whatnot. Or like to the fishermen. So th that would be really cool. Now, not only that, but if I have two more villagers, I might as well put one in a chicken coop. Um, for now, I'm gonna put one more in the kiln because we don't have, well, one guy died there and I'm really saddened about that. So let's get that guy in there as well. So he can start making more firewoods. Because basically we have so we have a lot of firewood, but we don't have enough people. And that's always a bad combination. Especially when we have a lot of other people in other stuff working their butts off. So yeah, they need they, they need to work somewhere, right? This one, dang, it used so much materials. Are you kidding me? A school? Why why it's so they should make like the like the schools like they have in some parts of the in the world. They have like a open schools, and apparently it even like increased productivity. Now I know in a European climate like this probably that wouldn't be the best idea if the kids are just there freezing outside. So I get it, but still in the summer they can learn outside. It doesn't have to really be big. It can be pretty small, I, I guess. But this is a lot of materials too waste is it waste though it's for the kids think of the children think of the children okay yeah we're gonna be thinking of the children so I... <sighs> early spring early bird gets the worm early spring let's get some materials going let's grow some flax let's grow some weeds let's grow some oats and then once we have the right amount of people Let's grow some chickens. That's that's the the <laughs> my main goal in the game is growing chickens. Oh boy, what happened to me? <laughs> so it is fall right in time, and we per we built our first school just in time to put a teacher in there before the school actually is 
Well, <laughs> before we have not enough teachers, so I'm gonna put a teacher in there and the kids haven't grown up yet. So that's just a perfect time to put them there. Bam, four kids already available in the school. Five kids and please another six one. See, people work faster and more efficiently than uneducated. So that's gonna be nice just in the right time to put someone in there and we have one kid grow up now i kind of wonder if that one will be boosted as well because basically i put everyone in there right before they start working there so i kind of hope it will make them faster more efficient that would be really cool not quite sure please don't let it be the school on fire okay hang on Oh, dang. No, the fire is there. That's also not good. I should maybe build like... Like uh, a well there. No, not a grid. That, that's, that's the wrong one. Maybe a well out there in the boonies would be a good idea for the future. I'll put one guy back to working as a builder. So now we have everything working as it should be. We have a school. That's cool. I really hope it's gonna work out properly and make my villagers like way faster. I don't I don't know how much it will actually do, but if it does something, I will be pretty happy. Um other than that, I'm gonna see if there's some like something with a leisure for having fun for the villagers. Garden house, what does that do? <laughs> That's a pretty big radius. But if it was me, a bad house would be even nicer to have and we're gonna build that one right there or maybe not right here okay that that's just it's perfect man. so a bad house increase the people's mood a little bit because i don't know how they are feeling but we want to, wow damn 77 years old the the oldest one that i've seen so far mm -hmm. wait 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 where were you Eleanor, oh ding, 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 no, 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 no. 77 years old. And she's still so active. Whoa, woman. You're fish farmer. Look at that. She works good. Her mood is, is pretty happy. That's, I guess that's why she's so healthy. So, like, she lives so long because the bathhouse, the thing that we build. Damn, their life must be pretty great right here. And they're gonna, it's gonna be even better because, they, well, the children have their play, their play stuff, which actually does nothing, but that house, they're gonna enjoy that. They're, I know I would, I know I would enjoy that one, but the, this one is empty. No. Oh my God. No, 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 no. Oh, that's just horrible. Hmm. That's just horrible. Okay, so let that one make a place. Okay, that, that's really unfortunate, right? Hmm. Is there something else that is about to be like empty? Why, why is that guy like a ZZZ? Are they sleeping? They cold? Hungry? I don't know what. what, what I don't know what they're doing. Why ZZZ? ZZZ. So anyway, that one, yeah, we have to disassemble that one because it's pretty useless. Um, a guy die, of course. Efrin. But I thought it would be Al Alien... Ali Al Alien... <laughs> I don't know the name anymore. Alienor, I think. She's already 77, but she's still fine. She, she's still... Where is she? 59, 59... Maybe she already died as well. No, it's Alienor. 77. Still fine. That guy, how old was he? I feel really bad for him. Well, at least, yeah, it is It is sad the way it is, but now we will have some new people and they will be educated. So they will get replaced eventually by uh, newer versions of... I wouldn't say better version, but... Newer versions of themselves? Faster versions? V versions dang it it sounds so weird when i say it like sounds like a, a 
different kind of word. Anyway. Hmm. <sighs> we don't have a stone mine anymore, so I might as well take two away from those guys. Um, and they can kind of start looking out for a different stone place to gather stone. And we're going to see stone, stone quarry. Oh man, it's really sad. Whoa! Oh, this one is was amazing. Why didn't I build it here? 5,300. Okay, you know what? 5,003. Okay, we're gonna build right there. Um, and then maybe. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. I think here. China. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna build it right there. I know it. I know it's it's kind of far away, but they're slow as heck anyway. And at least we will have. We, we're getting a lot of people actually right now. Okay, that's that's really cool. So the kids mostly are growing up. The bad house is ready. Dang, that's gonna make some people happy. Don't worry, once that one is finished, they're gonna be working even faster on the other one. Don't query. People's moods must be pretty good now, though. Like, I mean, yeah, they're they're pretty pretty good. I'm pretty happy that their mood is good. Are people actually gonna go inside it? I never see anyone go. Like, what's inside? Let's let's. See. Can I can I go inside? Yeah. Bad house. No. Oh. Wait, that that's the bad house. It's covered with snow. Who wants who in their right mind want to go in there? Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go, go, go lower. Can I see something? Something interesting? Oh, there's like a little fireplace. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. So now we've seen that. Oh, let's get someone in there. Um, chicken coop without someone to tend to the chickens is not gonna last a long time so fast forward to here our stone quarry is ready we have people working in them right now thank you miners you're doing an excellent job and look at that we got a second chicken Let, let's let's look up close oh isn't that just the cutest little chicken wow one more exactly the same wow i wonder if there's also like all white chickens that would be really, that's my favorite like the all all white chicken that's my favorite kind of chicken oh yeah but i'm pretty impressed with what we have right now so it's a cute little chickens oh so yeah i'm pretty happy we got our chicken coop finally my i hit my goal of my chicken coop now just to make sure that the chickens don't get eaten i think we need at least like 10 and then i will feel kind of safe like you know what even if one gets eaten no biggie it's fine. <sighs> Warehouse is ready as well. And as I predicted, the stone does get put in there. Now, it can also be the stone from up here. So that's not quite sure if that is actually the thing causing it. But it could be. Oh, damn. Fish farmer. Oh, why they always keep dying? Oh, my poor fish farmers. Anyway, um, the food is getting really low. So I'm going to enable the again and i think i'm gonna disable this one thank you villagers for like literally eating everything that i didn't want you to eat at that fast it's like i wasted a lot of time right now i feel really really annoyed with them right now actually um one thing i did learn from that is that i really need to terraform this little place and we well we're gonna need more bakeries i think at least like two or three and we need space for another windmill so yeah we're gonna have to work on that one in the next episode because this one is the final episode for today i'll see you guys soon again thank you so much for watching bye for now